Okay, folks, now in this uh, next segment of our ski test of ski discovery for the 2016-17 season, it's my honor to present to you a new ski, a new line of skis from K2 uh, called the Charger. And in this case, we have the Supercharger at 76 millimeter under the waist. Last year, we, we were kind of disappointed with the iconic series, the 85 in particular, that maybe did not deliver the expectation we we were bound to expect from k2 after the wonderful richter amp 90 and richter xti 82 of the previous year the iconic 85 was not on on target but man did they ever nailed it with this supercharger many reasons for that first of all we got a full laminated wood core with double titanium plate sandwich from at the bottom and one at the top. We also have this carbon web over the top sheet that brings extra lateral rigidity to the ski, stiffness. And we also have the full rocks technology here at this, what I call the weak point of every ski, which is the point that received the first impulse the first pressure when you go carving if this is too soft then the ski dies on you with this it seems like the rest of the pressure it's transmitted all through the rest of the ski creating a beautiful arc i mean some people prefer different type of arcs some people prefer the arc of a gs ski if they can carve it some people prefer the, the arc of a slalom ski, if they can carve it. In this case, I find absolutely no, nothing wrong with the way this ski is working on the snow at any moment of the turn. To start with, and down the fall line, and exiting on the tail, because they also put this carbon web on the back of the ski. Now this says it's a 17 meter radius. If you're lazy, it will do 17 meter radius. If you push on it, you can bring it down all the way to 12, which makes it a very joyful ski to any snow, uh, any type of condition. It grips on the ice, it grips on the carving and the groom. And what else can I say, but also that we have a tip rocker and a huge front tip of the ski to make sure that as soon as you put it on the edge, you get a great bite from the top of the ski and you hold on to your edge all the way to the back of the ski and then you can transfer to the other side. So, all in all, speed charger, a bit more GS, supercharger, exquisite for free skiing, and then the charger, which should be a little bit less in pricing as well. So you can find, I'm sure, one of the ski that you will just enjoy into the next K2 Charger series, and in this case, it comes with a marker uh, XL binding, which is just the same binding as the one you will find on a slalom speed wall or a GS speed wall from Vocal. So, a very decent plate system binding, lots of value for the price around a thousand dollar. Next year, one of ski to seriously consider is the Supercharger from K2.